This is a short video showing the bandoliers in the uh, Royal Armouries um, collection which came originally from the Tower of London. Right. Uh, this one is going to okay. be very difficult to move, that's the only thing. This one on the right here. Cause it's, right, okay. It's on a very floppy, big sheet of plaster, so this one will be lift out. Yeah. So okay, if you want to do this is all, something only the curator can do, is it really? <laughs> well, I'm happy got for you to hold that. Yeah. yeah. Um, okay. This is going to be tricky. Do you want me to hold something? I, do, I just we might want, want to, to do the video then coming out to see something. Yeah. If you can, if you think you can. Yeah. Oh, that's, hmm? that's great. Yeah. I can't see me managing right. this without. Want me to carry that one, right? No, okay. I'll you you've got the fragility as well of it being wrapped the. The belt being around that plastic thing, it's obviously yeah. quite a fragile condition, it's, isn't it? It's stitched with modern cotton yeah. or, or something yeah. to the right. to the thing, but I don't want to okay. put any pressure yeah. on it. Of course not, no. So these, don't these forget about that one. Yeah. We'll come back for that. When you say these are from the tower, um, does that mean that they're actually from London as well, or they could have been collected anywhere around the but country? The tower mean, collection. The, as in the Tower yeah. of London, yeah. where, where we used to be. Right, OK, so they weren't just, right, they were just part of the Tower collection rather than part of the Tower armouries, you know, because they didn't, didn't the Tower have its own it's, set no, of that's arms it, as well? That's, that's moved here. Right. As, uh, so are you, th are you thinking um, collected as a sort of museum item? Yes. Rather than yes. being sort of a munition yes. item already at the Tower? Yeah, exactly, yes. I don't know. Oh, you don't know. <laughs> okay, well, that's a good honest answer. I like it. But yeah. I understand what you mean. Uh, yeah. Going by the number, no, they do look that like is cupboard, probably something. what we would call old tower collection. Right. Which would be stuff that was simply there when they right. started thinking we'd better catalogue this stuff. My goodness me, they are a lot smaller than I thought they were going to be, except for this one here. This, this one looks, maybe that's the primer then, that one, because it's much longer than the others. But see how thin this belt is here. That's so tiny. You know, and the strings have no rings between them holding them together. <laughs> but anyway, let's go and have a look at yeah. these upstairs. All right. Okay. Maybe they were. <laughs> yes, they were, probably. Yeah. Right. hope I'm doing this right. I don't know. <laughs> right. Well, okay. you know, if you, if you, if you yeah. want to take a photo of something, let me know, because yeah. I can take, I can take yeah. one myself and email it to you. Oh, lovely. Thank you very much. Yeah, that's great. Well, some, some, you know, sometimes people are from America or something, and they're not going to come yeah. and see us, so... Once upstairs, I was able to take a much closer look at the four sections, uh, or rather the, so the four examples that we brought. We left the fifth one downstairs. Um, the one on the bottom left is the one that, um, that I've reproduced first of all, but I do intend to reproduce in detail the others. Let me just see. Oh, crikey, where are we? Here we go. I've got something else. I've got... Um, oh, no. That, that will... No, that won't work either, will it? So, uh, have I got anything? I've got vernier calipers in mm -hmm. here. Um, they should do for the mouth of Right. Oh, They'll do for the oh, mouth, really? yes. So, that will come under there, of course, and that, that will measure then the... Oh, I loosen that enough? There. That, that would me measure there, those there, mm -hmm. would measure the yep. internal bore. Now, this is a depth measure down here. That's how the vernier works.